and welcome to another VRTK tutorial video. In this video we're going to show how we can use our secondary grab action to control the direction of a grabbed object. Please consider becoming a VRTK patron. There are plenty of membership levels to sign up at and it really helps to fund these videos. So in our scene we've got two objects, this shotgun mesh and this simple gun mesh that I'll come back to later. Let's do the shotgun first. If we look at the shotgun we can see the orientation of this model is correct. So it's pointing down the forward of the world. It's up is pointing across the up and it's left is pointing across the left and right. If we look at the simple gun, we can see it's forward is actually pointing down the left and right of the world. And it's actual world forward is it's up and down. So this gun wouldn't actually work for the control direction. But we'll come back to this in a moment and see how we can fix it. So to start with, let's just turn both of these into interactable objects. So with both of them selected, we go to Window, then to Tilia, Interactions, Interactable Creator. And again, both of them selected, click Convert to Interactable. We can see both of them have now been converted into an interactable object. We can close the Interactable Creator window down now. So let's focus on our shotgun first. So with our shotgun selected, we want to set the primary action to follow. And we want to make sure our grab offset is orientation handle. And we'll just quickly set up the orientation handle, show orientation handle container. And then inside there, let's grab the generic orientation handle. And I'll quickly just position it where I think it would roughly be. So probably about there, I want my grab to go. And then let's rotate by about minus 25. So that's roughly where my hand will grab and it will orientate to there. Now the next thing we want to do on our shotgun is we want to change the second reaction to control direction. So what that will now do is when we grab it with our primary controller, it will snap to our controller and follow our controller around. And then when we grab the gun with our secondary controller, the direction or rotation of the gun will be controlled by the secondary controller. So it will feel like we're holding the gun with two hands. And that's all we need to do for this gun. Let's go and look at the second gun, simple gun. Again, we want to do the same things. Primary action is follow. And then the grab offset will be orientation handle. We'll come back to this in a moment. And the second reaction will be control direction. But as I said, this gun is orientated wrong. So we need to fix that. And this is simple enough. If we go to show mesh container, all we need to do is rotate the mesh container so the gun is the correct world orientation. So on our mesh container, we can see we need to rotate around our Y axis. If we rotate that around by minus 90, and then we need to rotate it around our X axis now. So if we do that by 90 as well, we can now see that our gun matches the correct orientation of our proper gun. And if we were to change our orientation to global, we can see that's now correct. So our up of our gun is our world up, and our forward of our gun is our world forward. So we just move this into a better position. So move it up a little bit. And there we go, we've got our gun now working in the right orientation, so we know our control direction will work. Finally, let's just set up the orientation handle quickly. And there we go, we've now got two guns set up that will both follow the primary grab controller, and then when we grab it with the secondary controller, they'll control direction. So let's jump into the scene and see that working. So now we're in the scene, we can see if we pick up our shotgun, it automatically snaps and it's following our controller around like a gun. And then if I have to grab with the secondary controller, we can see we can now control the direction of that gun. And then when we let go with our secondary controller, it snaps back as we expect. And as for our simple gun, if we pick that up, we can see again, we can move the direction of that with our secondary controller as well. I hope this video has been useful to you. If it has, please consider subscribing to the YouTube channel, leave any likes, dislikes, comments down below, and consider becoming a VRTK patron. Thanks for watching and bye for now.